What up, YouTube? It's your boy, J2s, and welcome back to another Juventus Career Mode episode. Now, guys, in the last episode, we ended up picking up Modric, and we were still looking to go after a right mid uh, for backup, basically, right? We got Mares. I want somebody that I can interchange with him, of course, and we still have a lot of money. We have about 28 mil to spend, uh, and that's dollars, guys, not pounds, so... Yeah, it's, it's dollars. It's less than pounds. I'm just saying. Uh, we did try to get Lucas. He is a bit high. Uh, and a lot of people were saying that, you know, maybe I shouldn't have paid that much. And I haven't paid that much for him as of yet. The transfer window is closing. We are at deadline day. We only have a couple of hours left. Ten hours to be exact. And there's still some moves that I want to make. Lucas would be, make a great addition to my team, I think. Uh, but since he is too expensive, what we're going to do is this, guys. We're going to go after a couple of other, um, well, players for that position and put in some bids and see what happens, all right? So I'm thinking about Willian. I am going to go ahead and approach Chelsea for Willian. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to offer... He's worth... He's worth 27. I'm going to go ahead and just offer. Now I'm going to low bowl because everybody says I overpay for everything. I'm going to go ahead and offer 25 mil for him. Uh, I think I'm going to offer 25 mil for every single player, to be honest. I still do have players up for sale, so hopefully a uh, team will come and pick up uh, those players for us. Hulk is another player that I would enjoy uh, bringing to the club. So let's go ahead and approach uh, Moscow and see what happens here. And again, I'm going to offer 25 mil uh, for him as well, just to see if it happens, guys. If we don't get anybody now, the winter window is going to open up and we'll be able to make some more moves there. There are players I still want to get rid of uh, on the team, then we can make moves there. I would like to go for, for uh, Douglas Costa, and I think I'm going to try, and we will play him out on the right. Uh, so let's go ahead and approach uh, Bayern for him. And again, just 25 mil on every single one of these players just to see if maybe uh, we get a bite and uh, and we can bring him to the club. Uh, even though they say, yeah, maybe I already tried for Douglas. I don't even remember. Delu is another player that I will uh, try to buy as well just in case. We're going to approach for him. I'm only going to offer, I'm going to offer 15 for him. Uh, just to see maybe we'll get him for 15. We'll try you know what I mean? Uh, we'll try for Thelu. Who else do I have on this list here? There are a lot of players. That I'm still going after um, Salah would be great as well. He has pace and uh, I do like to use that pace So let's go ahead and approach uh, Roma and see if maybe just maybe uh, What would I offer for him? Honestly, I don't know. He is 23 you know what, let's just go ahead with a 25. Guys, let me know down below if I'm overpaying. I think these players are worth the money, especially the way the real world is now. Everybody's paying a whole lot of money for players. Uh, it's just insane, to be honest. Um, Kandreva is another player which I think would do great here. So we're going to approach uh, Lazio to buy uh, Kandreva as well. And again, I'm going to offer... I'm going to offer 22 for him, not 25. Um... You know, and see if maybe they'll release him or, or sell him to us. I should say not release him to us, but yeah. And the last player that I think I'm going to put a bid on here, guys, is Faguli. 25 years old. Of course, we all know about him. Uh, so we'll approach Valencia and see if maybe, just maybe, we can pick him up. So 25, 81, if I remember overall, I could be wrong. Again, I'm going to try 22 for him, okay? We'll try 22 just to see what happens. Um... Again, just trying to put in these bids just to see if maybe we can pick up one last big purchase before the window closes. Here we go, guys. Are you guys ready? It's time to see. An hour is going to pass, and we do have some things in our mail, which is good. So, Valencia accepted. Lazio accepted. Roma accepted. Oh, my goodness. So many. We get Hulk gets rejected. Okay, Chelsea. Um Unaccepted. They want 51. So, and Florentina accepted as well. So, now I have to make my pick here. I really, 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 really like Kendreva. Wouldn't mind bringing Salah on as well. Or we could go with Faguli. We pay a little bit less with Faguli. We'll pay a little bit less with Faguli. But 22 for Kendreva. Maybe I'm overpaying. That's why they said yes right away. We could take Salah from Roma, and then that would set off the season for us even better. Uh, you know, crippling Roma, or even Lazio taking um, Kandreva away. You know what, guys? Give me one second. I'm going to check on these guys' stats and see which one is better for us. But I think I'm either going to go with Kandreva or um, Salah, to be honest. Give me one second. All right, guys. According to Foothead right now, right, Kandreva has a potential to go to 83. 
That's his potential. Uh, he's 28 years old, of course. Or we could go with... Uh, which I'm probably gonna go here. It has the potential to go to 87 with uh, Salah here. So what I'm gonna go ahead and do is gonna go ahead and accept this offer here for 25 mil. Uh, it's probably a very high number. Um, some of you guys might be upset with it, but I think he's well worth it. 23 years old, potential for 87. Uh, well worth developing, and I think he'll he'll make a fantastic addition to the club. So definitely gonna be going with that uh, option here. Uh, he wants to make 150. He wants to make 150 a week, which I think we can afford. Well, kind of afford. And he wants for four years. And he is going to be... He's going to be important to the team. Let's go ahead and see if maybe we can go ahead and bring him on. Um, we'll leave, of course, the Faguli, uh Candreva deals here as well, just to see. Uh, because if they if he rejects, we can still go after Candreva as well. Let's go ahead and sim through here. And uh, we'll have to see what's going to happen here in the office. We do get two more. We get an offer here. Uh, offer here. Set on loan. I'm going to go ahead and accept that. It's going to... I'm not going to use him regardless. He'll get a little bit better. Then he'll come back to us uh, better off here. We also get accepted. So uh, we're going to go ahead and pick up Salah to bring to the club, guys. I'm going to go ahead and accept that. It's going to leave us only with three mil and $9,000 in our budget. But... Well worth it, I think, guys, honestly. I'm going to go ahead and delete all this other stuff here because, honestly, it doesn't matter as of right now. Even though, you know, we could have maybe brought in uh, some of these other players. But, honestly, I think we've made a pretty damn good um, transfer this year. We did lose Marquisio, which I'm a little bit upset about. But we got uh, Modric instead. And now uh, we do have uh, Salah on the team as well, guys. So, um Every position has a, a superstar, basically, and we're good to go. We do have a couple hours left here. Um, talks. Yeah, I don't care. Don't care and don't care about any of that. I'm still trying to sell a couple of players, though. Want them to get off of the team completely just to help uh, the salary. Uh, what do we get here? We get a transfer as well. Um, Want to purchase here. 64. I'm going to counter... If you give me a mil, I'll give him to you. He's 18 years old. Just give me a mil, at least. Right? Just give me a mil. You think they'll give me a mil? Maybe. I, I want a mil for him, at least. I don't want to sell somebody for $525,000. That's horrible. Um, <laughs> a couple of more hours left here, guys. Honestly, I don't even know if we have any big uh, players still to sell. We do get an offer here. All right, we get two offers here. Um, they want to get him for 4.3. Honestly, I don't need him and I do want to sell him. But if they give me, if they give me, if they give me five, I'll let him go. He is 33 though, isn't he? How about this? We'll give him, if they give us four, six, we'll actually, I should just, I should just sell him. I should just sell him. We get 200,000 more than what he's worth. Um, we'll just do that. Maybe. I, I don't even know. Uh, honestly, but we don't need him. We don't need them. They counter offer again with 600. I'm going to go for the mill just because I can. Um, so, yeah. Just just trying to make as much money as I can, honestly, guys, on what we have here. We get... What is this? Oh, I don't I don't, I don't, don't care about any of this stuff, honestly. What is this about, Florida? Yeah, don't care about Delo right now. And we get an offer. Or no, never mind. And never mind. All right, cool. couple more hours left. Only five hours left in this. And we are... Still getting offers, I guess. Transfer offer here. So they just want to go. Should we just let... You know what? I'm just going to go ahead and accept it, guys. I'm going to accept it. Hell with it. We try to counter. I'm going to let him go. I'm going to let him go. There it is. I, I'm, I, I don't need him right now. We could pick up somebody in the winner um, as a... We're good on, on keepers, to be real. We got Buffon and I forget who else we have as our backup, but we are good. They're still going. You know what? I'm just going to go ahead and accept it. He's 18 years old. I'm going to go ahead and accept this as well. I don't care, honestly, right now. We'll accept it. Uh, they want to pay $775,000 for him. All right, cool. Let him go. I'm fine with it. Don't need him. And we also get... That's the same thing. Not worried about it. Okay. All good. Four, uh, four hours left before the window is closed. What else is going to happen? Anything good, hopefully? Yeah, it's over for... Yeah, I don't care about Delo right now. Player sold, player sold. 
Um, actually, you know what? What do we get? We get 3.7 mil added, and then we get uh, 650 added to our balance, um, which I'm, I'm fine with. We'll be able to make some moves in the winter. And like I said, guys, there are players I still want to get rid of in the winter. Just couldn't right now because they have just been transferred to the team as of now. Um, yeah, I will not be selling you, even though that's a lot of freaking money. That's a lot of money, honestly. 26 year old, 79 overall, but I need him just in case Ronaldo gets injured. I'm gonna go, yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna, don't even care. I should have just rejected that, honestly. And we also get, that's the Valencia offer, right? Yeah, I don't care about, um, don't care about anybody else. We got the squad that we need. I'm not worried about it, honestly. We're good to go, we're set for the season. Um, we're more than set for the season, I should say. And for the last hour here, guys, it looks like we are going to end up um, just about the way we started, to be real, and I'm okay with it. The deadline ends, um, and we spent a total of $109.4 million. That's a lot of freaking money I spent, but well worth it. Our team is stacked, guys. Our team looks good. Our team looks real good. All right, we got to take care of some development. Then we can get started into the season. I'm super excited about everything that's happened here. Hopefully, you guys are as well. Let me know down below, guys, if I overpaid on anybody. I'll try to improve. Uh, just remember, I'm not doing this with pounds. I'm doing this with dollars. So, you know, when it's really, really high numbers, it's not pounds. Just, just to let you guys know. Anyway, it is time to go ahead and take care of development. All right, guys, here it is. We are simming through development, and we are going to get decent grades. Yo, Mares did well for us, honestly. That's really, really good. All right, cool. So all done there with the development. And we are now ready to start uh, advancing through or simming through these weeks here to come up to our... Oh, no, no, no. Stop, stop. More development. Yo, stop already. I hit the button. More development time. All right, guys. Here it is. Development and bad grades all around. Bad grades all around. Great. Happy about all that good stuff. Um, <laughs> all right, let's keep simming and we got our match coming up here soon. Actually, we got two matches coming up here soon, uh, and we're going to have to worry about that. So, uh, we get an update here from Italy, which we don't care about ever, right? We don't care about updates right now. Not worried about anything on the squad. I do, and I have noticed that we do have another match coming up. I think it was a champion. Is a champions league match coming up right away or what was it? Let me check the calendar. Let me check the calendar. We have... Yep. So, we have the Champions Cup coming up as well, three days away. Um, so, I'm going to set up a secondary squad. I want to make sure that our main squad is uh, going to be fit and ready for this, this match here on Wednesday. So, I'm going to fix up my squads here real quick, guys. Have two different squads. Guys, down below, let me know which formations you think we should use. I usually stick to the 4-3-2-1 or the two strikers up front. That's just my... Uh, play style, but I'm willing to change things up. You guys let me know down below uh, what squads um, we should use for our team sheets. I'll be back as soon as I set up another team. All right, guys, so I've gone ahead and I set up another uh, team sheet here, of course, but what I've done is kept the same formation. I'm going to let you guys decide what formation we have. Actually, I should just show you the damn squad, right? I should show you every player we have, and then you guys let me know which formation you think we should run, and I'll set up a third team sheet, and we'll mess around with that. We can go three in the back. We do have three strong-ass um, well, three or four strong as uh, center backs that we could use. Our midfield is stacked. But again, guys, we have um, Zaza up front playing in the second uh, formation here. We're going to have, I don't know if, if Salah is going to be our starter or if Mares is. As of right now, we have Hernandez, Kadira, Preda. We have, you guys can see the squad here, guys. So you guys let me know with the squad that we have here right now, what formation do you think we should be using? Um... Uh, so I can set up a third team sheet, but we have a the lesser players I guess or not the super well They're still superstars. I don't even know man. We have our second strong squad in I guess I should say um, To go ahead and play the first well second third match of the season before the Champions League games start up um, So that's how we have everything set up here as of right now of course, we have our main squad there, uh, which is strong as hell. And again, I don't know about Mares if he's going to be on our second or or, or um, first squad as of yet. I'm going to interchange players as we go. But that's this is our main squad, guys. This is our strongest squad here. Uh, and I feel like we did a lot of great moves um, this, this, this transfer window. You guys let me know down below. But let me know which formation uh, we should run as our secondary or third um, team sheet setup. All right? What I'm going to do here, though, guys, is I do want to get into the next match soon. 
I do, I'm not going to play this match. I'm going to go ahead and sim it here. I am going to sim it with... Hold on a second. Nope, that's not that's not what I want to do. That's not what I want to do. Hold on, give me one sec. All right, guys, so what I've gone ahead and I've done is I switched to our second team sheet here. Instead of playing the match, like I said, we are going to sim it and hopefully get the win with it. Uh, at least I hope we can, right? I hope we can get the win. Uh, but let's go ahead and sim through here and see if if we can if we can do it. Let's go ahead. Let's hope and pray we can get our win here with our secondary squad, which is still strong as hell. We go ahead and start off in the first half here. Of course, uh, well, I thought I got a yellow for a minute. They went ahead and picked up a yellow. Still no score coming in. Oh, we've gone ahead and then done it. Juventus up by one in the 29th. Uh, and we are going to go into halftime up by one. Substitutions have been made. And, of course, uh, we made our own substitutions, I guess. I'm not really controlling anything. Still up by one. Hopefully, we don't draw here. Ronaldo Cup. Why the hell is Ronaldo in? I need it to rest him. But it's all good because it looks like we are going. I was about to say injury for us. Uh, it's going to go ahead and get the win there in the 90th up by one. Uh, we get the three points for uh, for, of course, uh, the season, which I'm happy about, and that is going to keep us in. All right, guys, after simming that match there, we have seven points. We are actually in uh, second place here. I forgot that we took a draw in the last uh, match. Um, well, not the last match, the match before in the last episode. So we are only with seven points in second place right now. That, of course, is going to be cleared up soon. I'm hoping that we should or we should be able to climb the table easily and win the season. At least I hope so. Uh, we'll have to see what's going to happen, but right now, we are looking good. Everything is fantastic, and, uh, well, development time, and we do have the Champions uh, League or the Champions Cup coming up as well, um, which we are in a difficult group against Real Madrid, Wolfsburg, so, yeah. Um, Real Madrid is going to be the tougher team to beat out of the group, I think, so we'll have to see. Anyway, development will sim through, and then we're ready to go into the next match here. All right, guys, development is happening, and we are going to get all bad. Well, that's, uh, yo, I'll take the one F. I'll take the one F for everybody else getting a B. Um, not bad. Not bad at all. All right, we got some stuff in the office. We get a press conference. Let's go ahead and do this. And again, guys, I never, ever, ever talk about anybody else but our own squad. And I want to motivate them for this coming up here. We do get something as well. Glad you believe that. No problem, bro. And you scored for us, so I'm happy you are going to get more opportunities until the winner when I get rid of your ass. But for right now, I'm going to use and abuse you when I can. All right, cool. So players are happy. Morale's moving. That's all we need. All right, time to sim through here. And we do... Have a match coming up here, and I'm nervous. I'm nervous, guys. I think, honestly, this is the first time in career mode that I'm actually in the champions. So, yeah. Uh, but, guys, we have done quite a lot here. We are going to get into the champions and to the rest of the season um, in the next episode. Uh, let me know what you think about all the purchases we made throughout this window. Let me know, uh, again, formations and stuff that you think we should be running. Um, let me know all that information down below, guys. Hopefully, you guys have enjoyed today's episode. If you have, please smash a like on the episode. If you're new to the channel and you enjoy, make sure to subscribe. And as always, guys, I appreciate you. Thank you guys so much for all the support. And I will see you guys in the next one. Deuces, baby. <laughs>